in this video we'll be connecting two ip cameras on one network cable we will be utilizing this device called an rg45 splitter this is how the device itself looks it's a pair of device that comes in this set or this manner and so i'll show you how the connection is done this part of the splitter pair which comes with the two rg45 connectors would be placed by the poe switch or the network switch that will be used for the ip camera installation and uh, you can see that it also has another rg45 plug point where we would be plugging the network cable so we'll connect this into the poe switch so it goes this way we'll plug each of them into separate ports on the poe switch so we have an end here that we'll use in connecting the network cable so from here we can use the network cable that will be carrying the signal to the two cameras so we can plug it into it this way all right so this other end of the cable will then be traveling to the location where the two cameras are supposed to be and this is where the second part of the splitter comes in so the network cable end that is coming from the poe switch will then be plugged into this one and the signal is then split again into two this can be directly connected into a network camera so let me connect it into one of my cameras so like this it can go direct into a camera and uh, you see that the camera has started blinking or lights on the camera have started blinking this other end provides an ethernet port where we can just plug an, uh, a patch cord or an, another network cable so we can connect into the second camera so here is uh, a patch cord that i can use to plug into this one and this is supposed to go into this camera but this particular camera is not a poe camera so i'll just uh, use the poe splitter but if it were a poe camera the patch cord can directly go into this to provide it with power and then also take the video from the camera but the camera is not a poe camera so i'll need a poe splitter to split the power and then the signal so it can simply go into my poe splitter when I put it in, you can see power has come in, which means that this cable that is coming in is already active. So we can just simply plug it into this second camera like this, and then also feed in the power. So like that. So it means that the camera side has also been completed. Very important here is the fact that these two cameras that you see here are all being carried to the network switch using a single network cable which is possible through this uh, rg45 split test that we are using in the circuit and you can see power present in the two cameras but to further test it i would like to connect it to my pc so that you can see the output of these cameras on screen so you can see the output of the two cameras on my screen and these two cameras have been connected through this same network cable that we connected through the rg45 splitters thank you so much for your time on this channel if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel please subscribe to the channel and also turn on the notification so you can always be notified anytime we come up with new videos like this thank you so much for watching see you in the next video